Downtown Rogers is getting a mural makeover. Stevie is here to tell us all about her work as a muralist. And Karen joins us to fill us in on what this means for Downtown Rogers. Thank you both so much for joining us. We yes, appreciate you. you. This is absolutely beautiful. Yes. <laughs> yes. It's a mosaic work as well. So, yes. Stevie, tell us about your work as a muralist, as an artist. Sure. Um, I became a, a mosaic artist about 16 years ago when I was a landscape designer in Dallas, Texas. And uh, over the years, I have transitioned completely into uh, mosaic art. And for the last couple of years, it has been mural art. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so well, tell us about that and specifically the project you have coming up in Rogers. Sure, sure. So uh, Karen Wagaman had contacted me uh, from the the uh, Rogers Lowell Chamber, sure. and uh, we are doing a mural in downtown Rogers, and it is six foot wide, ten foot tall, oh, and wow. it will be on <laughs> Second Street. Oh, here we go. And that was something we did in Bella Vista last year. Okay. So wow. some some large murals, murals. So it's it's taking about a month to get I, this one done. I okay. Bet. Yeah. <laughs> And there's an interactive component to this as well, because I know you said you're you're bringing it in, but then you've got people can come see you work. How okay. do, how's that going? Yes. So all of the major detail was done in my studio in Bentonville. We're bringing it in this week to uh, Rogers, and I will be available for people to see the process, talk about the process. So that will be the interactive part in the connection with the community. Okay. okay. And when is that happening? That will be starting Tuesday. Okay. So for the next two weeks. Tuesday through Saturday, I will be in the Rogers Exper Experimental House and available between, uh, I think we said 11 to 6. To six. Okay. okay, 11 mm -hmm. to 6. Wow, that is so impressive. Do you have a name for the new mural that's going to go up? Yes, it's Frisco Connects. Okay. Frisco mm -hmm. okay. Connects. So it's, mm -hmm. is it about the train? It, it really is historical, and okay. we've included several items from the, the city, including the tower, the train, the Frisco okay. logo. Yeah, yes. yeah awesome. awesome. Karen, let's talk about what this means for the city of Rogers to have even more artwork displayed. Well, this, this project came uh -huh. about because the Rogers Lowell Chamber received a grant from the Walmart Foundation to bring more art and entertainment mm -hmm. into downtown Rogers, bring more people to the heart of our community, and activate spaces. And it was wonderful to invite Stevie to put this um, project into action. It's going to be on the side of the Elks Lodge building at 121 West Walnut. So our busiest intersection in sure. downtown Rogers is second in Walnut. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Karen, as uh, we know that we have many artists here in Northwest Arkansas, we know downtown Rogers is great and the chamber about reaching art and having arts uh, artists display their work. If there's somebody out there and they're like, man, we would love to be connected to the chamber and, and maybe talk about how I can have my artwork up. How can they do that? Well, I work in downtown economic development at the Rogers Lowell Chamber, and I produce the Downtown Rogers Art Walk, which is the second Thursday of every month. Anyone is invited to apply to participate. We have themes every month, but that does not restrict who applies or, what, or the theme of the work. But um, we would love to have them visit our, our website, artonthebricks.com, and sure. learn more about it. Yeah, absolutely. Certainly. And we do talk about that often here yeah, we do. on Good yeah. Day in WA when it's happening. Stevie, a piece like this, how yeah. long did this take you? So this is about a two-week piece, okay. uh, give or take. Yeah. yeah. Wow. And then the piece that you have going up, you said you're going to be there starting Tuesday for two weeks. People can see your process. And then is it going to be displayed after that on, on the building? We will install on the 25th. Okay. So uh, we'll go through the pro production part of that. That, it will be in glory. Yeah, yeah. It's full glory. You can see it in downtown Rogers. Mm -hmm. Karen and Stevie, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so Thanks much. for this exciting project. And remember, you can find them out there at Rogers Experimental House starting on Tuesday and lasting for two weeks to see the process. That's right.